So what is the Mac Expo? Well, Mac Expo is a, uh, an exhibition for uh, school mechanical engineering students in their final year to present their work to the public. This is a project they do in their final year. They each spend around 300 hours on it. And it's like a contest. They're given a project and uh, they ask to deliver outcomes at the end of the day. And what you see today here is the outcome of these projects. Students work in groups of um, three to four and uh, they either do some research or they build a product or look at the feasibility of certain idea. And uh, today they present uh, what they found and uh, what they sort of ended up with at the end of the year. What is this project uh, entirely? Oh, this is actually called a die wheel. It's got two wheels here that are actually aligned and an inner frame that has the driver inside it that can move inside it. You actually drive it through a joystick, then that feeds a signal through to the motors, which then drives the motors and then allows the doll to uh, move around and also do some pretty cool tricks like you can flip upside down in it and drive around upside down. So what are the real life applications you can use for this? Well in terms of real life applications there hasn't really been uh, much research done into die wheels so it was this project was more of a design it, build it for the fun of it and to see if it would work and then we're thinking that industrial applications and things like that will come after. So what would you say you've gained from the experience overall? Oh, just chilling with the guys. <laughs> Um, I'd say it was a lot of fun putting the theory into practice. Everything you learn at, at uni and school, you, you really get to um, actually see happen in the physical system. And then, yeah, once you get in it, drive it, it's a pretty satisfying feeling. So what is your project? Um, our project is an autonomous painting robot. Basically allows you to automatically paint any image that you input into it onto any scalable vertical surface. So what do you see some real world applications with your project? Well basically nowadays um, billboard paintings are made by strips of XY plotted uh, sheets of paper and the idea of being able to implement these is that um, you can dynavolt these or attach these to any vertical surface and allow for large surface painting um, which reduces a lot of costs in the media industry um, which could even revolutionise the way that we produce advertisements or pictures. Cool. And now finally, what have you gained from uh, your working project at Engineering well, Adelaide? Yeah, well I guess it's been five years since uh, this double degree started and um, just being able to apply everything that we've learnt in control, in mechatronics and robotics and all the theory of, of matrices and just being able to implement that and program a MATLAB program that we've been learning for four years um, to a project such as this has been um, absolutely valuable in real life situations. So. so would you say it's a very rewarding experience? Oh definitely, I mean it encapsulates everything that we've pretty much done at university and allows us to do something more practical. What do you think the students gain from being at the Expo? Well, I think they uh, get an awareness of where science and engineering might lead them and see some practical applications of things that perhaps they haven't thought of before or maybe they've heard of in a wider context. And certainly, I think, uh, it challenges their thinking to a degree. Good. Um, yeah, for a lot of people in my school who are like, interested in mechanics and stuff, it's been really good for them. And Right now we're doing it at school so it's been pretty helpful. Yeah, it's really given me a good insight of what I want to do and like, all the things you can do in Adelaide Uni and the projects you can undertake. It's really, yeah, it's given me good information about the choices I can take when I leave high school. Um, it's pretty good, there's lots of stuff to do and interactive stuff and yeah, I'm liking it so far. Yeah, well it's given me heaps of insights into like the engineering uni base and what they do and what they can learn and 
how it's all run. 